For more on what Alex is uh, doing, first you should go to All American Investigations. That's the private investigator firm that he's affiliated with, copsforhire.com. Copsforhire.com. He's also blogs at renegadepopo.com. Uh, and you can find a link to all of that at our site, myfoxla.com. But there's one more site that you're recommending for our viewers. Yes, this is a website for whistleblowers called honestpolice.org. Honestpolice.org. It's for police officers all across the country, all over the world, who want to come. And if they have something to talk about or if they feel they're alone, like Frank Serpico was many years back in the early 70s yeah, when he New York, came out. New York. New York, yes. Uh, we're here for them. And, and we're glad that there are other people that are joining our ranks. Very quickly, do you still trust police? It's very scary uh, to say this, but no, uh, I don't think a lot of people trust the police. I realize that there are good officers out there. However, there's this culture that we need to deal with, this culture that we need to change. We need to talk about the beatings. We need to talk about these killings. We need to talk about some of these officers that harbor uh, racist, uh, you know, mentalities and issues. Mm -hmm. Not just racist, I would imagine, but bigoted, bigoted mentalities yes. as well. Yes. Because, you know, well, it's the... It's the classic thing. I grew up in Boyle Heights in East L.A. You were in uh, Azusa, but the image of the black and white driving by with the windows rolled up. and hmm? That's right. That's really scary because in the end, we all want to be treated like human beings. And whether you're black or, or you're brown, uh, you deserve to be treated uh, as a human. Mm -hmm. But the officers do as well. The officers do as well, too, but they know that they're dealing with this type of public out there. I mean, that's why people become police officers, and they shouldn't be police officers if they're going to allow their emotions to get the best of them, uh, as they once did to me, too. Because I, you know, as a news person, there are a bunch of crazy people out there. Right. we got to go. Thank you very much Thank for you, your sir. time. We appreciate it, and your honesty and your candor. And thanks to you for being with us. We'll be back here at 9 a.m. next Sunday. Thanks for being with us.